I think it's the natural way things will go. And th the reason why is electric motors are much simpler. Gasoline motors have so many moving parts. So much maintenance, so much fluid. What do we want to ban? Um, I'm Chaldean. No. Chaldeans actually don't have a country, but... Nice. It's in, like, modern-day Iraq. Oh, nah, bro. Clubhouse is hype. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, except it's also, like, every second comp game. That is true, yeah. But if you get good at Clubhouse... Holy, I can't talk. If you get good at Clubhouse, you're just good at comp, though. True. You just play it every single day. As well as Oregon. Club in Oregon and you just win. I mean, yeah. A man without a country, pretty much. I mean, yeah, like, electric cars could, you know, like I said, they're, they're, they'll be the natural progression. Logically. Over time. Once you, like, start looking at, like, what... Yeah, you know, I'm obviously not an expert in this stuff, so we're just talking for the shits, right? But electric motors are just so much simpler. That and they're more profitable for automakers. Right now, electric is seen as a luxury, but in the future, when costs actually come down on a lot of this stuff, it'll it'll be cheaper. Suck my balls, Jetto. Uh, uh, uh. Secure the area. Keep the bombs protected. All right. Mm -mm. Rude. Sorry about that, boss. Anyway, like I said, I, I do, I will say that I laugh pretty hard, though, when I see someone that, like, goes out and buys, like, a, like, a Tesla Model X, and they're like, doing my part to save the environment. <laughs> like, oh my god, shut the fuck up. Like, if you just want a Tesla Model X, that's, like, great, but, you know, <laughs> just shut the fuck up. We don't have any more walls, somehow. Where do our walls go? I'm not sure. Is all Middle Eastern food made in the spicy? Uh, some is. We don't have an asshole, they could rush us. Yeah. I mean, if somebody wants to buy a Tesla just because they want to, hey, you know, you got, I don't, I wouldn't probably, I wouldn't buy one, but, you know, no problems with me on that. Buy whatever the fuck you want, but just like, I find it very funny when they're, when they say that they're doing it to save the environment. It's like, bro, you're buying a brand new car when there was like pro pretty much nothing wrong with your old vehicle. Uh, it depends. I would say more Middle Eastern food is like savory, but it de it depends. Like, I don't know. We like stuff spicy, so my my wife puts like a spicy twist on like a lot of different types of food. I guess. Oh, I just la I laugh at people. It's like the, I mean, you know. At least from what I understand, the best environment the thing environmentally to do, especially if you have a working car that's like absolutely fine, is basically just to drive it into the yep, dirt. Like and like never replace it pretty much. But they'll like sell a perfectly good car 
and then buy like a brand new like hundred thousand dollar Tesla. One's on like the ladder of oil. I don't know if you can kill him. Uh, horse and carriage. Hey, dude. Horse and carriage is very environmentally friendly. One out four remaining. Uh, never mind. Oh, it's not oh, good. Dude, I didn't see anyone that round. Uh, you missed every you guys were having on. a 1v1 there, bro. <laughs> That oh, all 1v1. Dude, I was literally shooting at that guy for like two straight <laughs> minutes. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> yeah. Thai food? Oh, I love Thai food. Yeah. I'll bring Cade for the garage if someone wants to bend it. Um. Jaeger, yeah, I can go bend it. Oh wait, no more. We already have it. No, yeah. Let's go on the Josh. Jaeger or will my? Would yeah, be I got nice. you. That works too. About the emissions and stuff. Mm. I can play under. So basically, let me correct me if I'm wrong, because I could be. But my understanding for electric cars is that, like, when the electric car is produced, particularly the battery packs, they're environmentally worse than gasoline powered cars up front. But then, over, like, the next, like, X amount of years, they are more environmentally friendly over whatever the next X amount of years. But it's not like a major, major, major improvement. But it's yeah, you know, still an improvement, I guess. Hey, that is my understanding of it. Yeah, that is one nice thing too. Is you keep like the air in your like local community cleaner and stuff. That's a that's a big benefit, I guess. I mean, you're kind of just like. <laughs> We have, uh, oh. we have no wire. Oh, there's a. Uh, there's, careful. There's there's no there's no wire on our stairs. If somebody can play like main. We have bullet. on red. I I got one ace charge. They have two left though. Oh, okay. Her lion. I'm gonna see for this. They're they're probably gonna nade through the drone all in a sec. You're a bad the charger. You don't give a single shit about cars, really. Hmm. There's one near you, George. You can probably play off of that. Actually, you know what's kind of funny? There is a. Uh, <clears throat> There's like a fund that I like invest into, like a private like fund, and uh, they invested into a battery recycling company of some kind that like seems hopefully like it has potential. That'd be pretty cool. Lines also there, yeah. You watch my cam. Ah, which one? Yeah. Oh no, no, no. Oh. So the thing that sucks about the batteries, yeah, is if battery packs are not disposed of properly, they're fucking terrible. Uh, line 50. There's a oh, cam there, right. you can watch it. I got him, I got him, I got him. Yo, bo boxes down, downstairs, in lounge. I'll watch the garage cam. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm watching the, the, the cam. Never mind, okay. I'm watching the cam. One, I mean, bottom right, one, bottom one right. con. Let's try. Oh, I should have hit that. Yeah, I kind of lost the gun pit line and everything went downhill. Yeah. There's also this other company. Um, what's it called, too? They are still private and stuff like that as well. And they... It's fucking super cool, man. They're making, like, plastics out of, like, corn.
and it's crazy so like you could basically like if you have a straw like right now it's like two it's like not as cheap as like regular plastic but it's like if you if you have like a straw or whatever instead of it being made in like petroleum based plastic it's made out of like corn so you could like drink your drink and it it like doesn't dissolve inside of the cup so as you guys know i have a fucking deep and passionate hate for for paper straws they actually make me like they just they just want they make me to the point where um you know i just kind of want to take my drink and throw it at the fucking wall like a five-year-old <laughs> i hate i would literally just rather not have a straw i hate paper straws with a burning passion bro like they they literally just make me want they ruin my whole meal i actually just like throw, i did whatever if i ever get a paper straw I literally just take it out of my drink and I just put it on like the table and just drink my drink without a straw. Give me plastic or like whatever. If, if you want to do plant-based plastic, that's also fine. But do not fucking give me that garbage ass shit. Really, this is a rusty pipe. Give me plastic or give me death. Yep. Yeah what our forefathers would have wanted. I'm gonna cross, give me a sec. So I can put an ADS for you. Yep, thank you. Yeah, we didn't fight the British, okay? To have paper straws. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, if there's like a silicone straw, a metal straw, glass straw, I don't give a fuck, you could... There's one right outside the window. You can use any of those. I'm fine with any one of those fucking things. Just don't give me paper. Just give me nothing. I'm fine with nothing, but a paper straw just ruins my day. That's one of the fun comps said. I'm still playing top red. Paper straws are a fucking troll, bro. Mm. Bottom garage, bottom garage. I think I saw one cross. She's gonna ash under like moving, your right? shield, I think. Okay. Is he swamp or excuse me? That's the random. A hot dog straw? That guy's a freak. Reload! The are in place! Going towards top right. Nice, that's all the Habanos there. Canadians. One nade down. Bro. CC, one CC window apparently. English monarchy technically owns Canada. Oh. I mean, in practice, they never could really like pull it off, but like in around. theory, they do. Just res, I got, I got you. Yeah, okay, okay. Help. Op four, nice. last operator standing. Is it below, I believe. Below, okay. Oh, no, bottom swamp, right. swamp stairs, bottom garage. Okay. Could go cash. Uh, bendy straws bendy straws are actually super dog shit because bendy straws bend and then you get air bubbles inside of them and it makes your straw float out of your drink terrible actually dog shit they're literally like the fucking clash of straws don't talk to you all right Bendy straws are only okay as if you have like a drink that has a lid on it so that it doesn't go th like it doesn't go up. Then they're okay. But in a regular drink, no. I would never. I actually leave the straw unbent. I can try to go under stock, try to nade them. You need to use your drone to locate a mm -mm -mm. I'm actually excited about that company, though, dude. They already, um, basically, there's already companies that make, uh, no. straws that are... They already make straws that are, uh, 
like plant based and stuff like that, or they're like they're food based actually, but they just feel like plastic. But in like thirty days, they just dissolve. And if an animal eats them, it, it like you could digest it. Like you could hypothetically eat it. It feels like plastic, but you could eat it. Uh. Shit's fucking awesome. Do I hate them more than Neiman Mar- Oh, I fucking hate Neiman Marcus, bro. I hope they go bankrupt again, but this time permanently. Yeah, we can do the... Never mind, never mind. Stock clear, thing with two. Three on- Okay, all my- I- Bro, I- I hate that company. I know 100% why they went bankrupt, like, because they're just- they're insanely dog shit, and people go there, like, no one actually shops there. People only shop there to buy, like, gifts. Alright, I opened up the uh, A-Wall, too. I think there's one in con, like, close. That's Brafos. Oh, another one. One window, CC window, close. Black bang out! He's running near this. Oh, one's on the top right. Hold on. Door. Yeah. Beep, run this out. Um, oh, there's a BP. Right, yeah, just, just, I have a cam and master. So are they both in sight? Cash. Cash. Both should yeah. be in sight. Watching master cam. Oh, yeah, one's right here, right on the shield. I tagged him. Free kill. Nice. nice. That should be red. Yeah, yeah, red, red, red. He is not know where red is. Guy is lost. The diffuser is Fruity pebble flavored wafer straws. I used to just eat those. There's a cam on me, by the way. Nice. Molten salt, thorium, and heavy oh, water goodness. nuclear reactor companies. I don't know. I I. Bomb, bro. <laughs> bro, like everywhere except for where he was. I, I he basically I put money to this investment fund, and it's early seed investing for like companies that. It, it's basically it's 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 a venture capital fund essentially what it is. So they invest in a whole bunch of different shit. But they have to get like shareholder approval for everything, so like we vote basically on like what we're investing in. Moving on, Ascension. Whole packs of Gogurt, bro. Gogurt was the fucking shit as a kid. A PVC pipe straw. Gogurt still is the shit, dude. Gogurt is good enough that I would accept the diarrhea that comes with it. Lunchables? Lunchables are, are not as good as they used to be, man. I actually had a Lunchable, like, not, like, recently, recently, but maybe, like, two years ago. It was not as good as I remembered it. Oh, Gushers, bro. You're talking about Gushers. Do you guys remember the Sour Gushers? They still have those, by the way. Also not as good as they used to be. He double cap can Swamp Door, or maybe Blue Door, I don't know. And he, he cap can Stock Doors. Nuclear stuff. Um, yeah. I do see people parrot nuclear stuff a lot. The or yeah, I double claymore it. I mean, I think it's a, a good way to go potentially. The one thing that scares me about nuclear is like um, when things are not going right. You know, for example, um, there's a lot of things that you like can't really foresee happening. 
Yo, I'm gonna open garage. Like, what it, you know, if there's, if there's a, uh, let's just look at, like, COVID, right? Like, imagine COVID was way worse. Imagine there's, like, a bird flu outbreak. Right, or something, something crazy like that, right? Where there's, like, the worst case scenario, where it's, like, 50% death rate or some shit. It gets, like, kind of scary when you have, like, your, uh, your, like, power infrastructure is... Maybe not going to be taken care of like perfectly. I'm not talking about radioactivity and stuff. Oh my god, that guy just flashed. I'm I'm talking about like in a scenario where there's like, then basically you start to get like literal nuclear meltdowns. I'm gonna go breathe. Hold on. One in cash. Oh, that fucking evil eye is so. so this... One Black bang out. Could be going up the to top, Brad. He's sitting in the corner. You're so ugly. All you have to do is lower the control rods. Um. Right, my whole point is, is if there's if there's scenarios that are taking place, example, war, for example. Wars, right? So like even in even in Ukraine right now, there were active nuclear power plants that like were part of the conflict zone. Like these are all things that are like not normal operation for a plant and it's you know And it's not just lowering the control rods and that's it. I mean once again, I'm not an expert on this stuff, but I watched uh, a, like a nuclear in, like expert basically, and he was like for overall for nuclear. He said he was just giving his concerns basically. Okay. He's like he's like people paired it as being like the safest thing ever, blah 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 blah. He's like, but if things go wrong and you start having like literal nuclear meltdowns, he's like it could be like really bad. Mm -mm -mm. I'm just giving another perspective, that's all. I'm not disagreeing overall. I think nuclear is a good thing, but... Just giving, giving another perspective, just for uh, devil's advocate. Mm-mm... It is a concern, though, for real. It is definitely a concern. Ears pretty chill. Solar? I think solar is great. I think solar is pretty nice. The nice part about solar is, is like everybody hypothetically could be their own, like could be self-sustaining, which is pretty awesome. That's what I really like about solar. Like if every house has solar on it, then everybody basically generates their own power. Nah, uh, it's not, it's not, I'm not talking about Chernobyl, bro. That's not a good example. Yeah, I'm on it. Open blue. There's three, there's three backside, there's three backside. Yeah. Backside. There's, uh... There's three back arsenal, sorry. Yeah, I think there's only two now, hold on. There's no one blue? Where did it go? The time. One back arsenal and then one back arsenal. Changing mags! Mm -mm. You're talking to the other guy? Oh, yeah. There's there's just a lot of circumstances that you you can't foresee all circumstances. And, like, they're, they're going to be looking at me if you want. Hold, hold zero. Back sight, back sight, nice. One's tucking bitch, care. What's a bitch? Yep. This guy's a rat, bro. You're so ugly. It's insane. 
Uh, holy bunny there. Thank you very, very, very much for um, gifting five subs in a row. One to Scoopy, one to Mike, one to Trippin, one to Rockhard Fister, one to Mr. Anderson. Welcome to all five of you. If you're lucky enough to gift a sub from Holy Bunny, make sure you thank Holy Bunny in the chat and link up your Ubisoft account and Twitch account with exclamation point charm. Mm -mm -mm. I actually want to get solar for my house really bad. Not now, but like. I'm going to trick the wall again. Not now, but when I redo my roof, I will. I'm talking more about things like Fukushima and a tidal wave. Yeah, I mean, Fukushima's one, like, Fukushima started melting down, at least from what I understand, because they lost power because the storm was so bad, and they had backup generators, which should have allowed them to put the push the rods down basically, and stop the reactor from going in an emergency situation. But those generators got flooded over. Jump stop, Faye, I think that's 16, but three, so what's, what's going on? What's going on, jump stop? Oh. Like, you again. like, it's not something people could have, like, they had, like, multiple backup generators. And, like, you know, it's hard to account for that kind of stuff. There's always things, like, no one, clearly they spent tons of money and time and effort on the Fukushima plant, right? And, you know, nobody would have thought, oh, this is like, you know. Mm -mm. The investment for solar panels. The thing that I like about solar panels is, like, you just have your own power, which is cool. Yeah, they got stock power. You're shocked all the projects I've done with my house. I haven't done solar. The reason I haven't done solar is because if you do solar, you have to, like... Uh, and you need to redo your roof at some point, you have to rip your solar panels off and then rip your roof off and then put your roof back down and then your solar panels back down. DTE is like hyper dog shit. Alright, I got the kitchen hatch open even though it's caded. I'll get dirt too. That's pulse and cave. 3v3, they have a shield bottom main as well as careful. They have three pack tanks on the left side of the door bottom main. I don't. It's easy, man. I don't think DT allows you to sell power back. Second cams. Once in oil. oil. Mm -mm. DTE is really weird with uh, solar. You know, DTE actually limits the amount of solar panels in areas and stuff like that because they're so dog shit. So you have to, like, actually get approved by DTE. To, like, have solar. Like, you could, you could technically go full off-grid, but, like, the problem is, is if you live in Detroit, the power consumption... Or, sorry, the amount of power you're going to generate from solar will probably not be enough. Are you through dirt? Okay, yeah, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, a zombie just chilling over here. I'm gonna try to get her. One friendly operator remaining. Lose 50 HP. So fucked, bro. Mm -mm. Any calls? No, literally. Alibi was blue. There's a rotate on the right side of the blue. Actually, there is one there. Okay. Back arsenal. Yeah. Okay. 15 seconds left. Still got me. Shark. Four remaining. Ten. Okay, one more. Oh, oh, good shit. Oh. Thank you. Nice pings. Yeah. Good call. Woof. That's why he's the king. <laughs> God damn. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's just see. We did okay up here.
Find yourself a small module reactor. Oh yeah, I can't wait for the U.S. government to approve me to have my own personal nuclear reactor. <laughs> Air for Raptor, sorry. Secure the bombs. Bro, literally, I feel like everybody hates their power company. I don't think anybody's just like, wow, I fucking love my power company. I don't think that's like a thing ever. Alright, I'm gonna make Stark really <laughs> Get my own supercomputer powered by my own nuclear reactor. Uh, I'm also putting Get ready to engage. I don't have nuclear reactor money. I got like solar power money. <laughs> That's about it. Can someone play like top main? We have three people in Raptor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I was oh, okay. there. I have like eight to put down. One on CC window. Okay, one yeah, one's already out there. Um there They're breaking that. Oh, we only have one ADS on Running con side. There's probably a man touch again. Yep. Yeah. 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 They might start nading under a Suzami, be careful. Yo, 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 one's coming lobby. One's coming out, bar, bar, bar. Alright, I think I got ace. That was carrier down outside of master windows. Nice. Wait, this guy just blew up the Azami to give us, like, ability to watch when he grabs the bomb. Genius. One's in bar. It's not going. Uh, can you hard ping? Can you? Hot tub above the reactor. That's clutch as fuck. No. Got, got him, got him, got him. Master. Sledge is lit, okay? He's outside of the, the window on B. They grabbed the bomb and jumped in master. Last one, Doki, I think. Alright, if she jumps out, I got her. Okay. Nice. Bye. Let's go. <laughs> right? Give it a hot tub of the reactor. Free vasectomy. That was a good game, dude. Uh, that clutch felt good. Uh, 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 um... Free vasectomies! Mm -mm. <whistles> yep. That is true. The only time you're a like, people actually don't, it's crazy, there's, uh, people always think of, like, nuclear power plants as, like, boogeymen, but they're actually not, they're actually not that bad. Like, they don't produce a lot of, uh, irradiated, uh, you know, water or anything like that. Most of the time it is just, uh, there's, there are, um, there are, like, rocks concrete that's around you that probably has higher amounts of radiation. There's one in Monroe. Monroe? There is. My, one of my very good friends actually is like a plant manager there. Randomly. But yeah.
We actually, my wife and um, and I just ran to his wife like literally last week. But yeah, he's like a plant manager there.